as Tom said, we have a lot of exciting stuff happening here in City Walk. You know, City Walk has been the entrance to our resort with dining, shopping, and entertainment. And as the resort has grown, so have, so have we here at City Walk. This year alone, we're adding eight new venues, three by which you'll get a chance to sample tonight. Hot Dog Hall of Fame, Vivo Italian Kitchen, and Antojitos, authentic Mexican food. So I hope you have a great night this evening. Enjoy, drink, and eat some of our best food in, in City Walk. It is my pleasure right now to introduce to you Alan and Marcus from the Cowfish. Thank you, Vanessa. Hello, Orlando. Yeah. I feel like we should do a cowfish chant. You want to try one? When I say cow, you say fish. When I say cow, you say fish. Cow. Fish. Cow. Fish. Cow. Fish. Cow. Sorry, that was a little ad lib. And so was the tale of the cow and the fish from two separate places. They had but one wish to bring to the world in a way so delish an unusual place to enjoy a great dish. I'm Marcus. And I am Alan, and we are owners of the Cowfish Sushi Burger Bar. Ten years ago, Alan and I set out to open a little Pan-Asian restaurant in Huntersville, North Carolina. Woo! Yeah! Woo! Yeah! Yeah! Huntersville in the house. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, Those are two loud folks from Huntersville. Those are some crazy folks. So we were growing. Five years later, we found a location for a second site and as we were realizing the space was just too small, we couldn't fit, we couldn't fit sushi bar, alcohol bar, and have room for tables and chairs. Lo and behold, thank God, this clown over here was operating a gourmet burger joint next door. And I made a call one night. I called Marcus up and said, what if we tear down the wall between the existing spot for the burgers and this empty spot next door and make a sushi burger bar? And I said, you were an idiot. That is a horrible idea. You should stop drinking. It will never last. Anyway. We did it anyway. We, we, year later, we opened the first Cowfish Sushi Burger Bar in Charlotte, North Carolina. Whoop, whoop. The Cowfish <laughs> menu consists of big old gourmet hunkin' burgers, innovative fresh sushi, and check this. Our trademark, is it sushi? Is it burger? No. Burgushi. Let that one settle a while. We'll show the international sign for Burgushi here. Right there. <laughs> you got to practice that later on, see if one's doing There you go. Anyway, we had the, we had the menu, but uh, being that there weren't too many sushi burger bars out there, we had to figure out what it's supposed to look like. And that's where we got to have a lot of fun. We take the food very seriously, but we wanted to have a lot of fun with the look. We wanted to take a little bit of land, a little bit of sea, a little bit of uh, east meets west, cow and fish, vanilla ice meets Johnny Cash, and mix it all up together and kind of get its own, an entity in its own, and that's what we've done. Some with very vibrant colors, kind of irreverent pop art that's in your face, and you want to hit the down? There was one more piece that had been rolling around in the back of our head. We had a neighbor a few doors down from our original concept, Mike Feldman, who you'll meet tonight right with there. T1 Visions. You know, give it up for Mike Feldman. Yeah. Mike had a restaurant in Huntersville that featured touchscreen technology. The tables were actually touchscreen computers. And Mike was burning me down. He'd come into the restaurant and say, we got to put some of these into your restaurant. we got to do this. And I said, I don't have any money, man. We can't do that. <laughs> and, uh, and we kept pushing it off. Then the cowfish came about. And we had this unique opportunity to partner with T1 Visions. And today, the cowfish, we've actually used their technology as a cornerstone for what we're known for. Every sushi bar has a, as you're going to get to chant, use up here, a touch screen where Guests can read the newspaper, play games with the date, create a fish, drop into a virtual tank just behind the sushi bar. We work with them on a uh, app, a waitlist app, a wait waitlist system, and even the ability to communicate with guests live time at their table. So we boast two restaurants today, our original unit in Charlotte, North Carolina, and we last year we opened up another unit in my hometown of Raleigh, North Carolina. 
from the sky dropped Universal Studios coming around saying, how about we partner together and open up uh, the cowfish at Universal Studios? And we said, duh, that sounds like a good <laughs> idea. What do you think? So today we feel very fortunate that with our partners here at Universal Orlando, we get to uh, open one up here for you. So we invite you back once we get it off the ground. We hope you can, once these guys get it off the ground, love to have you guys come All of you are welcome to come join a meal on Modesto. Modesto uh, said he's got to tab only parties of 100 at a time. Thanks for having us here,